Country Shooter 98. Uh, today we're going to take a look at the glasses um, that I wear while I shoot. Uh, if you watch any of my past videos, you normally see me wearing these. Um, before we get too much into the details and specs of the glasses, I just want to say thank you to all of y'all been watching and supporting us and the ones who subscribed. And uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe and uh, hit the like button if you like the video. Um, we need all the support we can get. We really appreciate it. So anyways, um, first of all, I just want to say um, uh, if you're not going to get these, just please wear eye protection when you shoot. It's really important. Uh, you're shooting close targets, metal targets, whatever. You know, you can get some splatter on you quick or something could eject back in your in your face or whatever. It's really important to protect your eyes. I only got one set of them. Um, anyways, these are the ones that uh, I've tried different ones over the years and uh, come across these and really like them. These are the Oakley Flak Jacket 2. Um, they're comfortable and uh, everything still looks really clear when I'm looking through them. They're really neat. Uh, they advertise them a lot for different uh, people who are doing athletic things and competition type things because uh, you can drop them, do whatever. It's like they're like a rubber. Um, you're not gonna, you don't have to worry about breaking them or anything like that. Um, the nose piece is pretty comfortable. They're, they're rubber as well. Um, they don't dig into your nose and, and these don't, uh, rubber pieces here, they don't dig into the top or back of my ears either like some sunglasses do. So, so they're real comfortable and clear and obviously they're giving me um, the protection I need for my eyes while I'm shooting. Uh, price point, uh, it's all over the place. I've seen them. Um, it depends on if you get polarized or non-polarized and stuff like that. Um, these are the polarized ones. I actually come across a really good deal on eBay. I think I gave 125 for them. I've seen them higher and I've seen them lower. It just depends on if you get the polarized lenses or non. Um, they're on Amazon. Uh, you can get them several different places. Um, but I think they look good and uh, they're really comfortable and, and they're protecting my eyes. Uh, one of the cool things about it, other than uh, just the fact that they're basically all like rubber and you don't have to worry about dropping them, breaking them if you're out, you know, whatever it is, playing sports or uh, shooting, just whatever it is. One of the other really cool features is that I went on eBay and found uh, just some cheap safety type lenses for them um, so that way if I'm indoors shooting or if the sun's not out one day I can put these safety lenses in them and just wear them as straight up safety glasses not sunglasses um, and what's so cool about it is is how easily you can change the lens um, being that this is all basically just rubber more or less to change them out all you do is you grab it here by the nose piece then right here and you pull up and you just keep pulling it up the lens will just pop right out and then to put it in get the right one here you just line it up you put this side in first where it's got the grooves and then you pull it apart and push the lens up in there and you'll hear it pop and then boom you got safety lenses in there instead of sunglass lenses and you can use them for the indoor range or just on a cloudy day whatever it is so super cool I really like these um, that's pretty much all I wear now when I shoot indoors or outdoors. Um, but uh, like I said, it's just really important that you do protect your eyes. Um, when you're shooting, especially, you want to protect your eyes and your ears. It's really important. So, uh, like I said, somewhere, you're going to probably give somewhere between 150 and 175. It just depends on the lenses you get. These little safety lenses I found on eBay were like five bucks with free shipping. They're not any kind of special big name brand or nothing like that. Uh, you know, they're just cheap old plain safety glass lenses, which is all I needed. So, hope y'all enjoyed the video. Uh, be safe shooting, and we'll see you next time.